Check this out. So like if you're a guy with a hundred body count or you're a female with a hundred body count, you're still a whore. I don't believe a man can be a whore. Men are whore makers. No, Why can't a man be a whore? So let me ask you a question. Me and you playing Mortal Kombat. I'm playing it on hard mode, but I beat the game. You play it on easy mode, and you beat the game. Who has more respect out of the two of us? I mean, you obviously. Play because I played it on hard yeah. mode, right? So that's the difference between men and women. Men play sex on hard mode. Women play sex on easy mode. So like, don't think because you get fucked by somebody, you're somebody special. You're a woman. That ain't that impressive. It's not respectful. We don't respect you, right? So therefore we call them whores. A man has sex with three women. It was hard to do. You had to put in that work to get that. And I'll take it a step further, right? Think about and think about a bartender or someone working at a call center. They don't get paid that much. But the person that is building something, an architect, an engineer, those people get paid a whole lot more. Their salaries are just higher because the harder something is, the more respect you get, which means it's more monetary gain. The easier something is, you don't get a lot of respect. The Cause you're not valuable. You're just f***able. There's a big difference. Janitors, they don't get paid that much. The principal, he gets paid a whole lot. Maybe the janitor even does more work than the principal, but it takes more competence to be a principal than it does to be a janitor. So it's a competence level as well. So it's multiple factors, multiple ways where I could break it down, which a woman is a whore, a man is a whore. I wouldn't want to talk to no girl who ass out on Instagram, half naked every picture, just want a whole bunch of attention, turn around, they short, short as hell, they ass, literally your ass, you bent over on camera, gang, like... No man is gonna marry a woman that 200 men slammed and threw to the street. On Instagram, like, if I can't show my mama or my grandma, like, hey, hey, mama, look, this is my wife. Like, yeah, I'm gonna marry her. And she see your Instagram and you bent over with your ass out, your pussy showing through the shorts, like... Have some decency. Have some self-respect. fuck is going on? You got bitches talking about freak shit. It was a point in time where girls would be freaky as hell, but you would never know. Until you get with her and you talk to her and y'all get in the bedroom. Like, you got bitches talking about sucking dick on Twitter. These bitches is hoes. That's why. A, female, a lot of females is, is modern day prostitutes. What? They know who they are. They brand themselves. Tattoo on the lower back. Tattoos on the arm. Up the damn neck. Tattoo down the leg. That's the key. Tell you that I'm a hoe. So when I find a nice, classy, feminine, beautiful woman that's ready to take care of me, let me take care of her, and be a great mother to my children and a great wife to me, then y'all see me gone with a ring on my finger. And to the end, these hoes ain't even worth touching, gang. I hope you guys get to a point to where you won't even stick your f***ing women like that. If you enjoyed the content, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button or follow. And y'all be good. <laughs>